Yeah. yeah. I'm just gonna shoot a message to Erwin. You know what? Uh, you know. I think, uh, this is this is so cool, man. Like you got your. Yeah, this is my house. That is such. I got it all a mess right now because I'm doing some electrical wiring, but yeah, yeah, yeah. You're now you're you're into drones, and so you're, you're while you're on the road, you got to like set everything up. You got solar panels on the top yet? Yeah, I got a hundred watt. Oh, uh, nice. Uh, only a hundred. I think another one would would Have do. Have you heard of the name Mr. Steel? Yes. Yeah, he built a, an FPV van, so he went and got himself a Dodge uh, Promaster, I think it's called. Okay. So you know one of those newer work vans. Yeah, uh, the kind you can stand up inside and everything like that. And he just decked it out. Him and his dad went to town and like decked oh, out wow. the entire he van. Did. He got, just got a bare skeleton. And so he's got a whole walkthrough of videos of everything. That I'm he uh, to subscribed to him. Yeah. 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 And that's good because he's definitely one of the more active people in the FPV community. And if the money you're going to put into the hobby, it's best to put the right money in the right place when you're going to because then okay. you'll fly for longer. You'll enjoy it. You know, you'll be able to do the things that, that, that are going to push you yeah. and continue flying afterwards, right? Because the quality of the product that you purchase is directly related to how much, how much flying you can do as opposed yeah. to your, your learning curve. So your learning curve will go up faster if you can fly more often. So if every time you crash a drone, of course, there's going to be other things you learn, but your flight skill is not so going to So you think you want increase. to spend more spend money right up money. front? Just struggling to... <laughs> Watch this black and white screen for two minutes. <laughs> it's wiggling. Now your drone's probably like, what is that radio signal I did that? Okay. That's so intimidating to hear it in front of me and put my goggles on and not see. Oh, there it is. <laughs> oh, you can't see that, eh? Yeah. Oh, wow. Does that drone have a, a brand name? This one's called the Full Speed Leader 120. Okay. <laughs> so you found out that one had a net. <laughs> yeah, that was that was a fun one. See how I'm so smooth and everything? It's because I I learned about something called Expo, and it's how you tune roll side to side. Okay. And this is pitch, forward and back. Right. And pitch will like change which like they'll all change which direction I'm going to pay depending on how much throttle I have too. Like if I pitch forward and go. <laughs> then I move forward really fast, right? So, but at the same time, if I'm pitching, if I'm just flat and I, then I go up. Watch this. I'm gonna tilt on the stick, right? And I go left and right. If I if I tilt to the stick in the middle part, it does it all kind of slowly. But if I push it to the end, that's what. Oh, holy it smokes! Yeah, it does everything very quickly. Is that ever fast? Yeah, insanely fast, right? And if I take my finger off the throttle, <laughs> that's what air mode is. That's what I was telling you how it does that bounce if I land. And actually, I'll bring it in and show you from a distance. If I land, 